What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. Check out what we've got in front of us right now. This is the new Agco Ideal. Yo, we got some new mods today. Yes, we did. We got some new mods today. First things first, we have the Agco Ideal in many, many variations. I have the three versions here. We have the Massey, we got the Fent, oh yeah. And we got the Challenger. How did we get that? How did we get that at all? Check this out. So what you want to do is you want to go into Harvesters. You want to go all the way over right there. Agco Ideal. This is for everybody. PC, Mac, PlayStation 4, Xbox One. Oh, yeah. Main color. Change it. Anything you want. You can go black. You can go gray, green, red, which looks awesome. Orange, yellow, whatever you want. Rim color, you go gray, you go red, you go white, black, which looks amazing, I must say. And then design color, which changes a few of the interior designs. So let's change this to red so you can see. So it changes basically the seat color and little stuff like that. But if you want to go all black, look at that. Urgh, she's mean. Now, Will Brand, we got Trailer Borg and Michelin's. Boom, baby. Look at that. We got an American version now. Twin wheels. Yes. It's amazing. You want to leave it in trailer board? Totally fine. You got crawler track, standard, wide, and twin wheels there too. My goodness. Does that look good or what? Again, design is anything you'd like. You got the 8T and the 9T. Same horsepower requirements and everything. But my goodness. Is that not cool or what? An all black with twin web. You know what? We're going to get one of those. And we have headers for both of them. Oh, I'm so excited right now. I'm so sorry. I'm not. I'm not. We've got the Power Flow and we've got the Dynaflex. We're going to take a look at the Dynaflex. Both of these have the same options. So, main color and go black. Green. Of course, this is just changing the ends. Doesn't change anything else. There you go. We're going to go you know what give it some color we'll go with red and we'll keep it uh keep it a fent right there lease 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 boom 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 there you go what do you think about that is that not the meanest thing you've ever seen oh it looks so good i'm so excited we got a couple more things too we've got a new map new woodshire which i will be doing a full review of in just a little while we've also got a new shed and a new manure spreader let's go take a look at those Hopefully this thing doesn't overshadow what's going on in the background. Look at this right here. We have the Challenger Terrigator 9205. Goodness gracious. That is amazing. You're going to find this over in Vehicles and Crop Protection. You're going to go all the way to the right. $175,000. The only thing you can change are the main color and the design color. Now, Main color, of course, you can change it whatever you want. Of course, our go-to is pink, because pink is hot. So <laughs> there's your pink right there. Uh, let's change it to a little, little less. There we go. Blue, and then design color. Now, as far as I'm aware, design color is just changing that thing in the very back. You see the, the thing at the very, very back of it? Yeah, let's change it to green, just so you can see that. So that's kind of what's going on there. It doesn't change anything on the inside. doesn't change the wheels. So, you're still going to have to deal with that yellow color. So, I would recommend just hanging out, keeping it the same color. If you're going to do anything, I mean, maybe go all black with it. Black probably look good. Doesn't look too bad. <laughs> Doesn't look bad at all, I'll tell you what. So, there you go. That is that. Now, it is, well, as far as I'm seeing, only a manure spreader. Now, we can do a double check of this very easily by going finding challenger and then going over yep there it is that's it now it will hold 45,000 liters of manure so that's quite a bit 12 miles per hour working speed it says it's a self-driving manure spreader we knew that top speed of 26 miles per hour and a working width i believe and well it's not uh it's not giving us a telltale, so let's take a look. Has a working width of 24 meters. There you go, 24 meters. How do we hook this thing up? Well, let's jump in. I can tell you, it looks pretty darn, uh, 
Well, looks just fine is what it looks. It's a front with single wheel steer. This thing is crazy. So we're going to back up to our buy anything mod. There we go. Manure, it automatically understands and, and realizes what needs to be in it. And if I can spin this around and actually make it look decent. There we go. Fill this guy up with manure again. It will hold a lot of manure. While that's filling up, we've also got a new shed. We've got a Karen shed. Now this thing looks great. Oh, looks good. Look at that. Urgh. The thing looks good. It's just a nice shed. It's huge. I mean, it is really, really big. It is a big, big shed. It's good, though. Yeah, it looks really good. Design, detail, everything looks nice. Looks kind of the way it should. Got a poster board there, just in case you need to put something up. I can't do that, but... Uh, the only thing, no lights. I haven't seen any lights in here unless they're invisible. I have no lights. Regardless, let's take this Terrigator out and let's check it out. Just driving along, you can see and you can feel the massiveness that is this piece of machinery. It is enormous. So let's come right here. I believe we've already seeded this, but you know what? We're going to put manure down on it anyway. Let's unfold. It's going to bring that up and then turn on. Look at that spread. It's not too bad, not too bad. And you can hire a worker with this if you were curious. So workers will work with this just fine. How's about that? That's a heck of a view. I tell you what, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. The dirt is looking good on here as well. Man, you just can't get much better than that, can you? That is a beautiful sight. Well, guys, that is it for today. Those are your mods. There's not a whole lot, but they're awesome. And I think game-changing. This is going to be beneficial for a lot of people. Some good American mods today. Huge machinery. We've got the Challenger. We had the Ideal, the big Karen Shed. Good things are happening. Speaking of, we do have another map as well. New Woodshire. We're going to be checking that out a little bit later. So stay tuned for the channel for that. Guys, that is it. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you haven't already, make sure you get subscribed. Join the Goham fam. We're getting bigger and bigger every day. Make sure you join the club. Ah, yeah. Hope you guys have a great day. We will see you later. Peace.